Hi, right, today's video is at 103 Jamino Street, Warwick Neville, on the market with Northwest Real Estate for 169,000. This is a big four bedroom home, two living areas, and a double garage. We'll go and check it out. Just stepped inside the front door, you can see a big entry foyer with linen press on the left hand side, and on the ceiling is the reverse air conditioner uh, inlet. We've just gone to the left in the front room is bedroom number one. I think originally this was probably built as a lounge room, but uh, has been used as a bedroom, and uh, it's quite a big room. Just get coming along the passage, we've got to bedroom number two. Uh, this is quite a big room too. No built-in robes in this room either, but uh, easily fit a queen-size bed in here, and room for uh, freestanding robes. Bedroom number three. Uh, this is also a double room. I think this might have been the original master bedroom. Uh, it's got a good bank of built-in robes there. That door in front of us goes into the fourth bedroom or the office. And there's still plenty of room here for a good sized bed to go there. Just come down to the bathroom. So I've got a vanity, bath, shower over bath. And behind the cupboard, uh, behind the door, sorry, is a built-in cupboard. Just come back to the front of the house and to the right hand side of the passage is the lounge room. And uh, this is a big room. I think at some stage you can see the step down in the ceiling. It may have been extension put on there and pushed it out even further towards the front. There's an electric heat bank heater, but we have ducted reverse cycle heating and cooling throughout the house. So uh, that would be the most economical way of heating and cooling the house. Just stepped into the kitchen. You can see an electric side-by-side -side stove there, a pantry, uh, wood grain veneer, kitchen cupboards, bench tops are quite good. It's quite a spacious kitchen. We've got a rainwater tap over the sink. I'll pan around and you've got room for a dining room table there as well. This is the fourth bedroom or office, whichever way you want to go. So you've got a big bank of cupboards there. And if I swing around, there's more in behind me there. Very useful room, whichever way you want to go. We're at the back of the house and there's been an extension put on, well, probably in the 70s, and it's a big living area. This is quite a good room and really sets off the house. Big windows, a glass sliding door there. And if I move around, a bit further you'll see it has its own split system good big room very useful just stepped inside the internal laundry as you would expect there's a trough wash machine tap um, provisions there toilet every house has got one or at least one just come out in the backyard and you can see the double garage we'll go in there and have a look at that later and sweeping around, good yard, with an older garage there, which is very, still very useful for putting the mower and your garden tools in. Just around the corner is a bit of a fernery, ideal for putting your pot plants and stuff in. Just stepped inside the older garage. Behind that uh, wall is a wooden floored uh, workshop. Dirt floor in here, still pretty handy. We've just come down the backyard. See the back of the double garage, greenhouse, clothesline, just panning around. Got a rainwater tank, which is a good size. Back of the old garage, you can see the pump for the rainwater tank just there. Fruit trees. And up on the roof of the house, you can see a solar panel um, power system. Very handy to cut down your power bills. Just stepped inside the new garage. Uh, you can see one of the doors is an auto door. That door there is just a manual door. Good concrete floor. Very good space to park two cars. And uh, there's a PA door there. The owners have still got a bit of stuff to get out. But uh, there's power in here as well. Just come down the south side of the house and you can see concrete driveway. I'll just pan around to the garage. It's 
good access into the garage. And we'll just head down the side of the house. It's a weatherboard house, quite a wide profile weatherboard. Probably make it a bit easier to paint, I guess. But uh, nice it's leafy garden. This house is on the market with Northwest Real Estate for 169,000. My name's John Hadley and I can be contacted on 0428 560 630 if you have any questions about this property. Thank you for watching my video.